What's up YouTube? If you're new to my channel, welcome to the neighborhood. To all my subscribers, welcome back. As you see right here, we have the Google Chromecast. Now I went and picked um, this up uh, pretty much because I um, just got the 128 gigabyte uh, SanDisk SD card and I'm going to be downloading a bunch of movies. Now, as you can see right here, this is one of the newest versions. You know, the, when the version first came out, it only had support for Google Play Store, YouTube, Google, um, and I think Netflix. Now, as you can see, it has HBO Go, Pandora, Hulu Plus, MLB TV, and Watch ESPN. So, those are some new things you can, uh, new apps you can use with Chromecast as of now. Right here on the side, it says basically plug it into your TV, connect via Wi Fi, and enjoy HDMI. Um, as you can see, use your phone, display it on your TV. And that's pretty much it. So, what you're going to do, need to uh, use this, go to the Google Play Store and search Chromecast. Now download the app, it's totally free. Once you download it, go ahead and open it, set it up, it says turn on your Wi Fi, all of the above. Now we're gonna go right into this, unbox it. This is not a traditional unboxing, I'm gonna do a setup as well, but um, right here it says plug into power and TV. Um, Switch TV input to HDMI, set it up, go to Chromecast.com slash setup. Alright, here's the Chromecast dongle. There's your HDMI uh, port right there. This plastic on the side has a little shiny side right here. Then you have this little button. I think that's the reset button if I'm not mistaken and then you have your power supply now you do need um, power supply to uh, work this you just can't stick it into your HDMI port and it starts to work so let's see what we have in here it comes with the power cord uh, right here comes with this power cord to the input as you can see right there and it's micro USB cable um, you can also for some TVs they you they have a USB port in there you can just connect this to your dongle and connect it to the USB port but if you don't have it just connect it to the wall adapter and then um, you have <clears throat> this is an HDMI extender so you pretty much just plug the dongle into there and it extends it for TVs well that at an awkward angle for just the dongle and that's pretty much it as far as um, what's inside <clears throat> the box so what you're gonna pretty much have to do you know what I'm saying connect it to your Wi-Fi um, as soon as you put it connect it to your TV then connect it to your Wi-Fi and turn it give it power and switch to uh, HDMI um, output um, <clears throat> it will begin to set up um, out of the box you might need an update so go ahead and update it let it update download the Chromecast app like I said and once you do that it's gonna ask you to uh, via your device whether it's your tablet your phone whatever or your computer laptop it's gonna ask you to do to name it and all this. Um, there's videos that show you how to set this up. What I'm gonna do is show you how to stream your videos. Now, using this Chromecast, you only you need apps that support the Chromecast, which is YouTube, um, Hulu Plus, all those that I just named on the beginning. You need those to stream your video any videos from your device to your TV now there are some third-party apps such as um, all 
I think it's all cast by Clockwork Mod and uh, Real Player Cloud. Um, those like those apps like that that you can stream um, apps like Showbox and all that, and it works. But with Real Player Cloud, it only gives you maybe like three gigabytes to start, and you have to pay for the rest. So, yeah, pay like a monthly fee. So and then once you if you do do that anyway you have to upload the movie that you want to watch to the cloud then it takes time you can't just plug it in and watch it you got to upload the video then watch it with all cash you probably got you got to buy the premium version to get all the um all the streaming uh aspects of it so I found a little simple way just to stream your music I mean stream well music videos pictures anything you want via the dongle and you don't even have to you don't even have to connect this your phone it can be dead they say it's dead you need to charge it so all you have to do you can put this on charger somewhere and still stream your videos you know it's gonna take uh, some better life to stream your videos. So what you're gonna want to do is just in the app that I showed you, cut on your Wi-Fi, make sure everything's connected, and then go into the Chromecast. Okay. Now it's gonna connect to my Wi-Fi or whatever. I don't have it on my TV as of yet. I will show you guys a demonstration but once it's connecting to your your um once it's connect to your uh your wi-fi it's gonna tell you to do the, the ports and all that so where it comes in as you see devices and all that cast screen when you go to cast screen it's gonna search for your devices now i have these two matched up so when you cast screen, it's basically like when you, like a screen mirror, like anything happens on this screen goes to your TV via the Chromecast dongle. So if I want to watch a video, on, I'm watching a video on my phone, it's going to cast to the Chrome dongle. Now I'm going to show you guys how to do that uh, next. So right here you see my HDMI uh, ports. I'm just going to take my dongle and plug it in so the dongle is plugged in now like I said some TVs have the USB port right here or you can use your wall adapter I'm gonna plug mine into the USB port okay now that's plugged in right here now when I turn power on as you can see we have power to the Chromecast okay now you can change the backgrounds of your Chromecast and all that. I already set this up, so as you can see, hood tech, my um, everything is pretty much set up. But I just put the uh, background in. As you can see, it uses your pictures or its own backgrounds. So, like I was saying, I'm gonna go go into your um, Chromecast app again now once it says ready to cast hit it and it's gonna connect to the Chromecast okay and it says ready once it's ready to cast I mean you can do different stuff from your device whether it's a phone or a tablet go to cast screen cast screen connect to the Chromecast. Now, as you can see, right here, it says now casting the screen to Hood Tech, which is my Chromecast dongle. You look at the screen, it says the same thing. If I press home, see this is my home screen right here. Now, if I look at the TV, it's like a screen, it's casting the screen just like your screen record. You can move. See? So, that's via the TV. So, what you're going to want to do, 
I'm gonna go into uh, my gallery real quick and let's watch a movie let's do Dracula Dracula Untold hit that and it will start start playing Now, if I skip it a little bit. The Turks threatened to destroy my kingdom. Power like yours. Like I said, then you want to go home, get out of that. It's as simple as that. That's the easiest way I found to stream stuff um, via this. Um, you can do you can do your music as well. Now, if I wanted to go to my pictures you guys can see you can see my pictures okay now it does still work you know what I'm saying you go if you go to YouTube um, and there's a there's a little thing right there a little Wi-Fi with a little TV thing if you press that and go to um, cast screen mirroring hit that it will start the YouTube okay so any um, video you watch on YouTube it will go to the you know what I'm saying it will go to there so if I go to my recent uploads right here let's go if I just go to a video, press play, it will start playing on the TV. As you see, see this is the TV. What's up YouTube, this is your brother Teddy PhD 91 aka The Hood Tech, bringing you another video. So. I mean that's pretty much how this Chromecast thing works. You know what I'm saying you can stream, you can stream different um, videos, music, etc. Um, it's pretty much up to you. Um, but this is the easiest way I've seen it. To if I want to, you know what I'm saying, download video movies and watch them. This is an easy way for me. Go to the just to cast cast the screen. As you guys see, it's as simple as plugging it into your HDMI, plugging in into your USB port or the wall adapter, and connect it via Wi-Fi. You only can do it via Wi-Fi. So it's easy, simple, to the point. If you guys like this video, please give a thumbs up. It really helps. Um, thank you for watching. Shouts out to all my subscribers. All my loyal subscribers out there for hold, been holding me down since day one. Shouts out to y'all. Um, if you guys want to be a part of this experience, it's as easy as hitting that subscribe button below. Leave a comment if you guys have a, a Chromecast, if you guys want a Chromecast. If you think this video was helpful to you, if you had one or didn't have one, was uh, timid about getting one, did this help you as far as if this is what you want to do with it as far as streaming your, your movies? Like I said, I'm always here to help. This is your favorite. Your homie, your friend, your fellow droid head, the hood tech, signing out with another video. Peace.